Hello and welcome to the channel. In our last video, we learned about how to integrate Facebook SDK in our iOS app to get users logged in using their Facebook account. In today's video, we are covering the part 2 of that video series and in today's video, we will learn how to fetch the user profile using the Graph API in Facebook SDK for Swift. So let's start. So in order to integrate the Graph API, we have to go to facebookdevelopers.com and where the Facebook developer provide us the documentation for the required APIs in order to get the profile info of the user. So here we are in the doc section and Swift SDK. And here you can see Graph API link is there. So I will click on it. And here I will click on using the Graph API. And here we will go to common uses because getting profile is very common. So here you can see that get data about me. So we have to use the endpoint slash user ID in order to get the profile info. So in our part one series where we logged in using our Facebook account. So let's rerun the app and see what Facebook provides us. So I'm building the app. The build is succeeded. And the app is launched in iPhone 10 simulator. So let me tap on Facebook login. And continue. Uh, you are not seeing Facebook login page because I already logged in and the Facebook maintains session or access token for certain amount of time. So here, let's see. Here you can see we have access token and app ID authentication token is there. And we also have the user ID. So we can use this user ID to get more detail about my profile that is the login user profile so here this is the access token and this token give us the detail so we will use this and let's create the method so here we will create a method function get user profile and now what we required users access token and the permissions okay so here this is the endpoint that is the request it goes to this endpoint and with user id and fields is equal to id name and etc etc so what we will do graph request connection for this so let connection is equals to graph request connection and then connection dot add request Graph request for graph part and here I will pass my user ID or I can use let's try using me and here I have to pass the parameters as mentioned here in the doc that is this field ID okay so let's pass these because it's a dictionary so we need to pass same so let's pass F I E L D S fields and in any this is also string and it requires all these
also let's bring ID again and here it need access token so we will use this access token of type access token and or either we can use access token dot current it will return us the current access token associated so we don't need this so let's remove it and here dot get because we are using get and here graph api version dot default version so it will return the default version as per our sdk installation in our code so now this is here now we need the response so what we'll do just curly braces and here we have http or you can similar simply say response comma result and in and now this is our callback okay now here we can either print this result or use the response and results so here it also provide switch statements so here switch sorry result No okay sorry I misspelled it so it should be a switch result and then here case dot success it has parameter response to so say let response and then break and the other is case dot failed and here we have let error and here we will print error if we get any so we have error fetching user profile or you can say logged in user profile is equals to equals to error dot localized description okay now in response what we will get so let's print this out to print logged in user Facebook ID is equals to equals to response dot here it has dictionary value okay and here we have ID as a key ID okay so this will print our ID associated with the logged in user and secondly we can also fetch the name and here we have key name okay this is put it here and fix this okay now we remove those warning and now let's run the app so whenever we get access token we will get user profile method gets called and now let's run the app here it should be self because it's inside the block and lastly we need to start the connections connection dot 
start and now let's run the app again so here I will tap on Facebook login continue and let's remove the logs press continue and here you can see that it's printing my name and my user ID so here this is a small tutorial that tells you how to get user profile information from graph API in IS using Facebook Swift SDK if you have any question or queries then please feel free to comment in the comment section and I will try to answer your questions as soon as I can and if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up and please do share this video now if you haven't subscribed to our channel then please subscribe it as we are going to bring more tutorials on Swift language for iOS applications and lastly thanks for watching bye for now